Terracotta Creation presents Quantum Observer, connecting Vedas with modern science. Science is only now discovering what the ancient Vedas have known for millennia, that reality is shaped by the observer. In quantum physics, this is called the observer effect, but in Vedanta, it is known as Turiya, the ultimate observer. Is our consciousness shaping reality? Are we truly separate from the universe, or are we the very force that brings it into existence? Today we explore how modern quantum mechanics aligns perfectly with the wisdom of the Upanishads. In the vast expanse of the cosmos nestled amidst swirling galaxies and twinkling stars lies a realm of profound mystery. Here the familiar laws of physics, those that govern our everyday experiences, seem to dissolve into a strange and wondrous dance of possibilities. Imagine a world where particles can exist in multiple states at once. A world where the very act of observation shapes the fabric of existence. This is the captivating realm of quantum mechanics, a field that has both captivated and perplexed scientists for over a century. It is a realm where the line between observer and observed blurs, and where the nature of reality itself comes into question. For centuries, we believed that the universe was a giant clockwork mechanism, predictable and deterministic. Quantum mechanics challenges this view. It suggests a reality that is fluid, dynamic, and intimately intertwined with the act of observation. In this essay, we embark on a journey into the heart of this enigma, exploring the profound implications of quantum mechanics and its surprising resonance with ancient Vedic wisdom. In quantum physics, a system can exist in multiple states at once, a concept known as superposition. But something strange happens when we observe it. The mere act of observation collapses the infinite possibilities into a single reality. But what does this mean? Is consciousness playing a direct role in shaping the universe? This is the essence of the observer effect, with profound implications for our understanding of the cosmos. The Mandukya Upanishad describes four states of consciousness. Jagrat, waking state, where we perceive the material world. Swapna, dream state, where reality is fluid and subjective. Sushupti, deep sleep, where all experiences dissolve into stillness. Turiya, pure awareness, the state beyond observation, beyond time, beyond measurement. Turiya is the silent observer, experiencing reality in its uncollapsed form, just like a quantum system before measurement. It is the ultimate witness, never interacting, yet always aware. It is the state where the universe remains in superposition. Segment 3. Consciousness and the Quantum Field Modern physics is beginning to question the role of the observer in shaping reality. Scientists like John Wheeler suggested that the universe does not exist in a definite state until it is observed. This aligns perfectly with Vedantic wisdom. Reality is not separate from the observer, it emerges because of it. The ancient Vedic phrase Tattvamasi, you are that, reveals the same truth. You are not just in the universe, you are the observer shaping it. Just as the quantum world holds infinite possibilities until measured, so too does our consciousness hold the power to shape reality. Section 5. Consciousness and Creation. A Tapestry of Awareness. The parallels between the observer effect in quantum mechanics and the concept of Turiya in Vedantic thought are striking. Both suggest that consciousness is not merely a passive observer of reality, but an active participant in shaping it. In the quantum world, the act of observation collapses the wave function, transforming potentiality into actuality. In Vedantic thought, Turiya, the pure consciousness, is the unchanging backdrop against which the drama of creation unfolds. Could it be that consciousness, as suggested by both quantum mechanics and ancient wisdom traditions, is a fundamental aspect of reality itself? Could it be that the universe is not a cold, indifferent machine, but a living, conscious entity, a tapestry woven from the threads of awareness? These are profound questions, questions that science alone may not be able to answer. 
perhaps a synthesis of scientific inquiry and spiritual exploration is needed to unravel the deepest mysteries of the cosmos and our place within it. Science and spirituality are not separate. They are different ways of understanding the same eternal truth. Quantum physics speaks of a universe shaped by observation. Vedanta describes the Turiya state as the ultimate observer. Both reveal that awareness is fundamental to existence. In the end, whether through science or through deep meditation, the realization is the same. Reality is not something we observe. Reality is something we create. Section 6. A Symphony of Unity, Where Science and Spirituality Dance As we stand at the cusp of a new era of scientific discovery, it is becoming increasingly clear that the universe is a far stranger and more wondrous place than we ever imagined. Quantum mechanics, with its mind-boggling implications, challenges our very notions of reality and the role of consciousness in shaping it. At the same time, ancient wisdom traditions like Vedanta offer profound insights into the nature of consciousness and its relationship to the cosmos. While the language and symbolism may differ, both science and spirituality seem to be pointing towards the same underlying truth, that the universe is not a collection of separate, unrelated parts, but a unified whole, interconnected and interdependent. Perhaps the true journey of discovery lies not in pitting science against spirituality, but in seeking a harmonious synthesis of the two. By embracing both the rational and the intuitive, the empirical and the mystical, we may yet unlock the deepest secrets of the cosmos and our place within its grand unfolding story. If you found this connection between ancient wisdom and modern science fascinating, join us in exploring the deeper mysteries of the universe. Like, subscribe and comment. Let's decode reality together.